What's up guys, Jordan Wren here with Zenith Audio Recording, uh, back for another tutorial. It's been a really long time and I'm glad to be back. Today we're going to be working on mixing some drums and we're going to be using the equalizer to enhance the relationship between the kick and the snare. I got a track here from a local artist, Kat Jackson. Uh, we're going to be working with it today, so let's take a listen of this section and uh, we'll know what we're working with. Alright, now let's take a listen to just the drums alone. Okay, uh, so if you look right here, we're increasing the thump of the kick and the click. And then on the snare, uh, on the snare, we are boosting the body uh, right around 200. Um, and then we're boosting a little bit of the um, crack as well up here at seven. Now notice where we boosted on the kick and the snare. We boosted exactly one octave higher on the snare than on the kick. This is going to allow them to blend together a lot more naturally inside the track. So now let's take a listen and to compare it with and without the equalization. Try it without. It loses a lot. Uh, now without the compressors. Uh, we're losing a lot of volume taking those compressors off. So. Put them back on. Now without. And with. Alright, now let's listen to it all together. Alright, well there you have it, a new technique for you to help marry your kick and your snare in your next track. I just want to say thank you to all the new supporters. Uh, we're almost at 2,000 likes on Facebook, on our Facebook page, which is absolutely incredible. And then on our YouTube, uh, which has actually been quite inactive for some time, uh, is, act is I think we broke 300, so pretty excited about that. Again, thank you guys. Uh, please click the like button, uh, subscribe, and definitely share it. Uh, the more views I get, um, the more I'm going to be doing this. See ya.